Racing in the farewell plate, missing the kick of the length at the start, there was bring it on. Lady Escort holding the rails, dictate terms close to about half a length in front of Rosebrook. For the length beyond traveling too deep off the fences, Rushmore being cracked on the inside there by seeking nicely, stalking the pace for the length and a half to two lengths beyond. We've got Gangton on the inside of Gangton. We've got Asian Warrior for the back in the field. We've got Victoria's Secret. Red Hot Jet comes in next, being cracked on the outside by Decisive. After that, we've got Bring It On as they continue the journey towards the monument. Back to the leader, it's Lady Ascot by about a length in front of Rosebrook in second position. On the outside, traveling about three deep off the fence, we've got Rushmore. Gangton is making a quick forward move, traveling about five wide off the fence. Seeking is in between horses. Further back in the field, we've got Asian Warrior. On the outside is Decisive Push to make a forward move. Victoria's Secret is in between horses. Further back in the field, we've got Bring It On. As the field turn towards the home stretch for the running of the farewell plate, round the turn and into the Straight and it's still Lady Ascot in a start to finish bit close to about a length, length and a half in front of Asian Warrior is the one on chase. For the length and a half to two lengths beyond, we've got the other runners of Seeking racing in the final 150 meters. Lady Ascot has opened up a five six lengths gap to the better of Asian Warrior. Racing in the final 50, it's a one-horse race with Lady Ascot wins it very impressively close to about five lengths in front of the other runners of. Uh, Asian Warrior for the back in the field. We've got Booms Lang with the money. Decisive seeking for the back then to bring it on. Ganton Victoria's Secret for the back. There was a Red Hot Jet and ending up last there was Rose Brook.